David from Dash Off Road. If you like watching caravan tips and tricks, this is the channel for you. Today we're going to talk about reversing and what could make your life a little bit easier when you're going backwards. Let's get into it. Tip number one. Number one slash 101, the first thing you need to do is have a spotter of some sort. Uh, and two-way communication, whether that's just as simple as a mobile phone, um, both of you put it on speaker, or uh, I use a UHF and my lovely wife. Number two, your mirrors. When you're going backwards, left is right and right is left, and it can get a bit tricky when you're towing. So, and then if you turn your head around and look backwards, it's in reverse, again, or normal. Hope you get what I mean there. But to neuro adapt what's left and right, it's best to keep looking one way. So just, especially towing in a straight line backwards, just use your mirrors. Don't ever turn your head over your shoulder, just rely on your mirrors and your spotter. And what I'm looking for is uh, if I can see more of the van in one side than the other side. And if I do, I just turn the direction that I see the van in. Does that make sense? I'll try and show you. So you can see my van is getting a bit out of shape here. There's more of the van in this mirror. See how I can see the angle of the van now than the other van. I can't see the back of the van at all in that mirror. So I need to turn my steering wheel towards the van, the, the mirror that's where the van is more placed. So my steering wheel, I want to move it to about that two o'clock side. And you watch it straighten up. That's exactly what I want to see. And out the other side, it's straight as well. Now, for the sake of it, I'm gonna overcorrect here and watch it go out of shape. You can see how now I can start to see the end of my van in that mirror. So what I want to do with the steering wheel, I want to turn the steering wheel towards That, that mirror and you watch it all straighten up. There we go. This tip. So you need to position your rig in the right spot if you're going to be turning into a driveway. What is the right spot? Well, usually you want to position your rig in the middle of the road. Um, that gives you enough turning room to kick the back out and then as the front of your vehicle, your car, swings around, you need space there before you run over the next door neighbor's flowers. So um, about the middle of the road is a good spot, not over to one side or the other. Next tip, your mirrors are dynamic. I know we set them to look backwards, but what we should do is set them um, to look at the caravan tyres that's our car mirrors, and then we the extended mirrors we set to look down the side of the van. Now, why do we do that? Well, it's always good to see what your tyres are about to go up a curb or a gutter or what they're going to do, or when you need to um, find the apex of the turn which you're turning into. Move your mirrors, don't just leave them static. Press that little button that you've got down there and hunt around for the apex that you need to do, and as you're reversing in, move the mirrors as you reverse too. Um, you see what you're doing and you'll line up much better. I hope you liked these tips and tricks. I do lots of them every fortnight actually. Check out my channel, hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out as well. Uh, if you love this page, I also have a Patreon website. So go to patreon.com, look up Dash Off Road and you'll see me and it will show you how you can support me even further. Can't thank you enough for watching. I'll see you next time. Yeah, yeah.